Hey everybody, back with a new Patreon request. This is from Chris. He's requesting the 12th episode of Merlin, uh, the penultimate episode of season one. I can't believe we're already here, but uh, last episode was really good. Arthur had to learn his lesson, kill the unicorn, curse the land, drought, famine, fell onto it, and he had to prove himself, uh, and he did. Um, with no help from his father, he, he passed the test and uh, saved Merlin's life and, and proved how much Merlin means to him and how much he cares about his people. Um, so yeah, I really like that episode. Uh, this next episode is called To Kill the King. So is someone coming for Uther? Would I care? I don't know. <laughs> I doubt it, but let's see. Here we go. Oh, and thanks for this request. That's her father? Yeah. He's Oh, yeah? What's going on? So this guy paid him a lot of money to do this. Is he an alchemist? Oh, no. Is Gwen's dad going to be in trouble? How'd you know about him? Please, you're under arrest. Oh, no. What kind of feeling? Powerful magic here in Camelot. Oh no. Torin, the leader of a band of renegade sorcerers sworn to bring down the king. Well, did he know that he was a known enemy? Man. He's a blacksmith. He could have been paid for shoeing Torin's horse. In gold. This is madness. You don't know. You condemn a man with no proof. I have enough proof. I love Morgana. Father, the blacksmith committed a crime. I don't know for certain he meant treason. The law stands or this kingdom falls. But the law must give him a fair trial. He'll get a fair trial, and he'll be found guilty, because that's what he is. You execute Gwen's father, and I will never forgive you. Never. That won't stop him. Torrance experiment bears all the hallmarks of alchemy. Do you think that's what might be? You can just sense it. Ooh, be careful, Morgana. Wow. Is it calling to him? There's no hope. There's no hope, Merlin. No! Don't give up no. all hope. I've gotten out of some stuff before. Can I help him escape? Where's he gonna go? This is a very serious crime. Giving a man a bed for the night. Not a man, a sorcerer. Maybe they didn't know. They didn't know. You to question my father's actions. Is that understood? How would you question them? Yes, oh, smart. Yeah, that's how you get out of there. Oh, wait, I thought you were going to take his uniform. It's you just, just took his weapon? And we'll kill him on sight. You really should have done the whole outfit switcheroo. Oh, no. This didn't work at all. Oh my god. It's my responsibility to protect the people of this land from its enemies. Then the kingdom is doomed. For one by one you make enemies of us all. You speak treason, Morgana. Only a madman hears the truth is treason. Oh, oh, oh. Take care, child, or I'll have you restrained. You just try. Morgana. God, was he for sure gonna get killed? Any of like it sucks that Morgana helping right. got him killed faster. Maybe something else could have been I done. Why is he trying to escape? His child was this morning. Guinevere, I want you to know that your job is safe. And that your home is yours for life. And? I'm sorry. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Well, he was very sweet, but God, you should have done more. Arthur. Stand up to your fucking father. I mean, I don't doubt he would put Arthur right there with Morgana. So. <gasps> no. Bring it to me, or you'll die. Hasn't she been through enough? I don't make myself clear. Was Mor Morgana acting so brazen because she has the stone? 
Does the king's little helper bring a message, or have you just come to glitch? Oof. You're free to go. Next time I might not be able to help you. Well, I'm glad you did, but... Thank you. You should be saying a lot of the things that she did. Always worry. It wasn't about my father, was it? You have enough to deal with without worrying about such things. I shouldn't have done that. She felt guilty. Not on my behalf. She gave him the key. To you, I can... Oh, girls. You need to go home, Gwen. Torrin? She, she can help. He she has it. He threatened me. He was looking for some kind of stone. Morgana, what's going on? Dangerous. Good thing Merlin's on your tail. Surrounded. Where's your maid? I've come in a place. Kill her. No, wait, 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 wait. What else have you brought, my lady? The stone. That's all you need. You are a warrior. If you kill me, you'll regret it. Because I will do the dead too. You, an enemy of the king. Is it usual for Uther to chain his friends to a dungeon wall? She is fired up. A good man died in your quest for Witch's Torn. His daughter is now an orphan. I'm sorry for that. Are you? Truly. You're all right. Hmm? What are you gonna do, Marla? Yeah. Don't you want Uther dead? It is Uther that persecutes you and your kind, Marla. It really? is Uther that murders the innocent. But surely that doesn't make it right to kill him. Free up! I'm really surprised by everyone's actions in this episode. Morgana, the fucking dragon. I'm not surprised by Uther ever. I know what it's like to lose a father. You promised him reinforcements and then gave him them. Ooh. You sent him to his death. That is not true. Ooh, she played you. What is her plan? Uther, do you think he's good for the kingdom? He's no Joffrey, but he sucks. Yes. Most of his methods are right. Sometimes he may go too far. Really? You mean like executing anyone who even passes a sorcerer on the street? Yeah, he goes so far yes. all of the time. Let Arthur be king. Arthur's not ready. The responsibility will be too great. Brave though he may be, he lacks experience. He lacks judgment. Guys, it's something I've got to work out for myself. I know you'll make the right decision. But what is the right decision? I realize I may have been insensitive. I should have foreseen may? the stress that your man's loss would cause you. No, this doesn't help Gwen's dad. He's that, still I'm dead. Sorry. Let us visit my father's grave together and put the past behind us. Morgana. Nothing would give me greater happiness. We've never seen her like this. Is she okay? The thing I find hardest to bear is that people will always think he was guilty because he tried to escape. Oh, and that's on Morgana. I think he tried to escape because he knew that whatever he said or did, he'd be killed. True. Uther had already made up his mind. He had. That's the kind of man he is. Would you kill him? For what he did? No. Yeah, that's not going. But it is Morgana right now. Are you gonna have a change of heart? She seems so dead when set. When Dolores died, I lost the truest friend I ever had. You challenge me as a friend must, as your father did in his time. And when I do, you cut me knives. Yeah. I know I'm not yeah. an easy man. My temper blinds me sometimes. There are things that I regret. You have to learn from these mistakes, I though. You don't get better. Oh man, oh Merlin. You've been a blessing to me, my brother. You are the daughter I never had. Oh. Your counsel is invaluable, as is your friendship. Oh my god. Please forgive me, Morgana. So she did have a change of heart. Merlin, get up! 
Morgana? Oh. How many men were there? Three? Uh, four? Yeah, 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 something like that. Morgana must have shown extraordinary courage to have defended a king against such odds. I suppose you had nothing to do with it. Mm -mm. Oh, you know, just background stuff. <laughs> no need to be so modest, madam. It's not a criticism. It's a compliment. Yeah, you, right. you did the right thing. Thanks, guys. I definitely think this was the darkest episode of the show. Um, and I think a, a lot of a lot of the problems we hear were people not communicating with each other. Uh, I think Morgana should have told Gwen about the key and let her make that decision. I wish there was a little bit more emphasis on Gwen's point of view, um, but I'm really happy that Merlin went and talked to her and she really was the voice of reason here. If anybody was going to say this is not what we should do, it would be her because she is the one that was affected the most by this tragedy. And it was a real tragedy. Her dad was trying to make some money, come up in the world, but uh, he did not know that it was a sorcerer and he wasn't intending to take down Uther. Uther has got to get better about this kind of stuff. And the, the speech that he made at the end to Morgana was sweet. And it does show that side of him that we don't get to see very often. But uh, he keeps ruling in this way that makes people want to kill him. You know, like he can't see everyone as an enemy without giving them some kind of voice and Gwen's dad was going to pass, you know, get to have the trial, but I don't know if Uther at that point would have spared him. Uh Morgana is right. He, he if you're if you are seen with an enemy, you are considered an enemy to him. But maybe that would have given him time to cool down and maybe he wouldn't have killed Gwen's dad. So I wonder if Morgana's ever going to tell Gwen that she's the one that gave him the key. Because she went from him having low odds to no odds because he, I mean, he didn't have to use it. That is true. But uh, I think he thought what we all thought is that Uther was going to give him a death sentence. Just a terrible situation. I feel so bad for Gwen. Oh, God. I mean, she gets to keep her, she gets to keep her job and she still has her friends, but um, with her dad, it's a big deal. And you know, I don't like Uther either. I, th I think he's too harsh a ruler. I don't, I don't, I, I agree with what Merlin ultimately decided to do. Um, and a lot of that has to do with what Gwen wanted. Um, she didn't want to become just as bad as he was what he did um and that's really big of her i'm really shocked about the dragon being like hey we need to have we need to have a sorcery back magic back here and uh do what you got to do let arthur rise up and you know gaius was also a, a voice of reason here saying that arthur's not ready so um yeah you just gotta i guess keep keep working on Uther, keep challenging his rule. I mean, Morgana had got a night in the uh, dungeon for it, but uh, she said what he needed to hear because he did back down from how, how harsh he was being. Um, but in the end, it didn't save her dad, you know. This was a big episode for Morgana. I've never seen her like that before, but it did pull up some old trauma for her with her dad. And it was good for her to hear Uther speak about her dad in a way that let her know that they actually were friends and he didn't intentionally get her dad killed because I think she probably thought he didn't care as much, uh, it's especially seeing how he treated Gwen's dad. So she really kind of 
really wanted to kill his ass. <laughs> and I can't say I blame her. But uh, in the end, she saved his life. Really interesting episode. And, and, and I really like the focus on Morgana. But like I said, I would have liked a little bit more f from Gwen since this directed, this was her dad's death, you know. Um, and I liked Arthur consoling her in the only way he can, even though it's like, yeah, my dad did that. <laughs> How do you even like make up for that? Um, but you know, Merlin and Morgana both did the right thing in the end. I, in my estimation, even though I could see why a lot of people think he should be killed. But, uh, yeah, I'm, I'm just really curious to see how Morgana is going to act now after this toward Uther, toward Gwen. Um, pretty fascinating. Um, and you know, they didn't mention anything with the little stone or whatever. I guess they just buried him with it. I don't know. But alchemy is can be a dangerous thing. And if you had that kind of power of turning something into something else, uh, I think that would put a target on you. So maybe it's best if it just goes away. But yeah, I really like this episode. It was it was tough. It was a tough watch. I feel bad for Gwen's dad. Got wrapped into something he didn't know was what was really going on. And he paid with his life. And that's sad. So yeah, one more episode to go. This was this was good, and I don't know if anything off of this episode is going to be leading into the next episode of, you know, what it would be about. But, I, yeah, I'm really excited to see the finale. So, thank you for this request, and I'll see you guys later.